side we have three buildings. Uh, this next to us is the Icton building. Right behind there is the Commonwealth building. And beyond that is the Clinical Research Center. So my name is Paul and I'm part of the Single Molecule Imaging Group uh, here at the uh, LMS. Uh, so I'm on the 10th floor of the Commonwealth Building, so I've got a really beautiful view of London, uh, which is the perk, but at the same time means I've got a lot of sunlight, which is not so good for my experiments because I'm actually working with floor fours and those are very light sensitive. Um, so when I applied, I really liked the application process here because it was kind of a more general application process, so you applied to the institute rather than a specific group, which was really nice. Um, and then when you come and do the interview day, you have a poster session. You can basically look at all the projects that are available and then apply for the ones you like. If you are joining our institute, obviously you'll find a lot of support from the get-go. Don't be scared of, of going and asking for help or even for advice or just, just to, to socialize and meet new people. Don't be scared of approaching people. Um, and of course, keep in mind that PhDs are a journey, they're not something, they're not linear, it's not like they're always going to work out in the way you expect them, there's going to be high moments and low moments. And the other thing I would say would be don't ever be disappointed by failure, like it takes at least five times before something works anyway. If everything is done right and something's not working yeah. or if I'm doing this colorimetric assay and the color won't change and I don't know why it's not changing, and it should change, <laughs> and it's not. <laughs> and it, yeah, it's very frustrating. That's okay, like, so technique sort of hit, hitting, repeatedly hitting a wall yeah. when there's no clear reason as to why something yeah, isn't Yeah, I think that's the most can frustrating, be frustrating. Yeah. for me at the moment. Yeah. But then when you solve that issue, do you not but find that rewarding? Great. Yeah, and then it's like, this is why I'm so frustrated, because then when it works, you're like, yes. Yeah. This is the moment. <laughs> and then it's great again. And now we've just hired a new postdoc who does um, molecular dynamic um, simulations. So he's looking at like the 3D crystal structure of proteins or RNAs and DNAs and how they interact and like how they move in real time and stuff. It's all modeling, so. It's really cool, but I mean, everybody does like really different, Very different stuff. stuff. Yeah, so. yeah. The exciting thing about doing a PhD at LMS is the um, really excellent research that's going on here. Um, there, were, there were very many people who are, are really um, leading their their fields and doing doing exciting projects and and maybe one thing that's slightly unusual about the LMS is there's quite a broad range of um, scientific interests here and so um, it's uh, it's an interesting place to be to learn new things that are slightly outside of your your area of expertise. Are you doing the rounders thing? Uh, yeah what is that? I, I, saw, I saw it was like family. Oh uh, yeah it's quite fun so like you Normally, like your group has like a team. So, like we joined with like Boris's group. Okay. Last year we won it. We were oh, Boris's wow. babe, and we got the trophy. Is it, is it here? Yeah, it's just on the, okay. on the Wormwood Scrubs okay. outside back. Okay.